All right, hello everybody. We have here the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 with uh, Verizon. On the other hand, we have the Nexus, Google Nexus 7. Uh, this is a new uh, 1.2 quad core processor, seven inch tablet. I'm gonna go over the specs and uh, give you a tour around the devices and uh, we're gonna do some uh, benchmarking tests and uh, look at all the options. The uh, tablet is a seven inch tablet. Here's the, on this side, there's a little microphone here. There's nothing on the top. There's a, another microphone right there. On this other side, we have the volume rocker, the power button. On the bottom, we have the USB port and the 3.5 millimeter jack. On the back, right here, there's a the speaker. And we have the Nexus uh, logo or, or, or brand on the back. The material of the back, it's like a rubberized uh, plastic material. It feels nice to the touch. Uh, on the other side, the Samsung Galaxy Note 2. Uh, it's a 1.6 quad core, two gig of RAM. Uh, we have here on this side the volume rocker. The bottom we have the USB port. There's a microphone right here. We have the, uh, the S Pen. On this other side, we have the power button. On top, we have another microphone here and the 3.5 millimeter jack. Uh, the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 has a two megapixel front facing camera and it comes with eight megapixel rear camera and a flash. And this is a silver titanium version of uh, Samsung Galaxy Note 2. The tablet, it's a 1.2 quad core and it has only one gig of RAM. Both devices are running the latest version of Android, Jelly Bean. Uh, let me show you around. Let's open the browser. I'm using right now Google Chrome on both uh, devices. The browsing experience is really nice. The zoom in and out is quick. I'm not sure if it's because of the size of the screen, but on the tablet, you get tabs on top. And then on the cell phone, you basically have to click it here in the corner to be able to go between one tab or another. Uh, you can add another tab. Here, um, like I said, on the tablet, we have the tabs on top. It's easy to navigate between one tab or another. It's quick. So that's uh, the browser. Uh, let's look at uh, some quadrant test.
Okay, so here we go. The tablet is really light. It's actually thin, as you can see from the side. It also has a really nice resolution. It's actually HD. The Samsung Galaxy Note 2 has also high definition screen. Both devices are running in the high performance mode. We'll see the results in a moment. Okay, so the Galaxy Note 2 finish, the tablet finish too. Let's look at the results. Okay, so the tablet score 39.85. Right here, 3985. The Samsung Galaxy Note 2 scored 6011. It's uh, the very first uh, score, 6011. So, as you can see, as far as performance in terms of uh, processor and memory, the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 kills this tablet. Uh, let's look at couple of other things. Uh, let's look at the speakers. So. I'm going to turn the volume all the way up. And play something else, guys. So there's the volume all the way up. There are the speakers. It's not bad, but it's not, it doesn't get as loud as the Samsung Galaxy Note 2. Uh, let me show you here. Let's look at a different one. That's the volume all the way up. So that's a uh, radio station testing the volume. Let's look at YouTube. Uh, let's. 
play this video right here. Let's play the same video on the tablet. I mean, on the phone. I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but the the quality of the colors and the resolution on the phone are actually better than the tablet. Everything looks more clear and uh, more uh, sat saturated on the phone. But other than that, you two works really good. Let's look at something else. Let's look at maps. Let's uh, zoom in. As far as maps, both devices looks really nice. It also comes with the Google Voice, which is actually really nice. Let's see if we can test it on both uh, devices. What's the weather like? It's 28 degrees and partly cloudy in Bellevue. What's the weather like in New York? Three degrees and overcast in New York. How much is two plus two? What's the weather like in Panama City, Panama? It's 88 degrees and cloudy in Panama. Okay, so that's a uh, Google Voice, it works really good. So here's a, how the apps look inside of a, the tablet. Here's inside of the phone. Now, the one thing I have to tell you is that I couldn't find any application to launch the camera on the tablet. I'm assuming it's because it's only a front-facing camera, so it's only good if you're gonna do like video chatting or video conference. But that's the one downside about this tablet. It doesn't have a back camera or flash. Other than that, the tablet looks, looks really nice. It's really light. It, it performs fast. It's really snappy.
and I highly recommend it. The tablet, it's about $249. Uh, that's a co review comparison of the Samsung Galaxy Note 2, a 1.6 quad core with 2 gig of RAM, and the Google Nexus 7 tablet, 7 inch tablet with 1.2 quad core processor and 1 gig of RAM. Thanks for watching, guys.